Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. I am It's Rex and, I, and this is Daily Rambles. Today we're doing Silver Moon, the original series. I'm doing season one, episode two, called Punishment Awaits. And then it says, the house of fortune is the monster mansion. Okay, so we have a little recap at the beginning, which I'm not gonna do, so that will recap and then there's talk about fortune telling it's super popular right now so it's like a trend that's going on and um or a oh, barrel again wants a crystal back in the negaverse i think that's what it's called or whatever and again she gets a no <laughs> And then Luna wakes up to Usagi and she's late again for school. And then we have Umino has a crush on Usagi. And I'll really laugh at him because she's like that. Th no, that's not going to happen. Sorry. And basically tells him to go to a fortune teller to see if it's really good. If, to not embarrass himself, basically. <laughs> it's like, see what the fortune teller says and it's going to happen. Then, okay, then do it. So he says he will. Then Usagi goes to see the fortune guy. And, uh... She says that guy likes him, but she thinks it's just needed a mask and not Umino. And then she's gonna say maybe it's Mataki, who is um, the arcade guy, who she also has a crush on. And so she plays a game, and then Luna interrupts. Okay, back. Okay, so actually she left the portion now. She's going to her, to the arcade to see Mataki. Okay. Then Una, Luna interrupts, and then. Um, Usagi goes to support, tries to go see the fortune guy again, but he left already. So she tries a shoe trick, and that hits Mamoru in the head, and <laughs> then the whole thing happens again where they are pissed at each other, and they walk away from each other. And then we have Umino is at the new fortune place, and he gets entranced, and then Usagi runs into her dad, and then Umino, um the next day is being a total douchebag and embarrasses the teacher like hiking up her skirt which is so crazy like that no and then she's then he, him and a couple other people that got in trance um, start throwing rocks through the window so Usagi um, shows up at Sailor Moon and cries them away and they go to the house of fortune her and Luna, and then Sailor Moon gets help again from Tetsuya Mask, and says so Sailor Moon offs the monster, and then Naru tells Umino about everything that happened while he was in that trance. And then he gets super embarrassed, and he's like, okay, I'm grounded forever, and I'll be suspended forever. So, um, I gave this one another A. I thought it was really good. Um, I really enjoyed it, but I'd never seen this before. <laughs> uh, this was not an original, um, it wasn't in the one in the 90s. Like, obviously it was done in the 90s, but it wasn't shown in America. So that was, this was completely new for me because I've seen every episode up until like, what, The Unicorn, I think, was the last one they actually dubbed in um, America. So, um, yeah, I thought that was really, really interesting because I know, um, I think seasons one and two were, um, they had the updated music and everything, but when season three and four kicked around, I feel like they went back to the original music. So, um, anyway. That's one for this video. <laughs> but anyway, I, I thought it was super interesting, because I was like, oh, I've never seen this. I, I kind of understand why, because, like, you know, people don't really do that, period. So, anyway. That's one for this video, so it's video, please go to like, comment down below, tell me what you think, do you agree, disagree, tell me your thoughts down below. Don't forget to subscribe, because that's out the channel a lot. And I'll see y'all in my next video. Bye, everybody.